Hi guys, so, oh my gosh, it is the last, the final video of getting ready for my vacation with my horses and you guys don't know how very excited I am. I am basically jumping up and down in bed every morning and at night waiting for the day which is in four days or three i can't remember anymore because i'm so excited to come and i am so excited for some of my like models to come with me and have a lot of fun so i'm gonna start off by showing you my trailer right now because I did a bit of prep before I started filming and I just put in some shaving no not shavings bedding I use um felt cut into strips which is very good it's very soft so it doesn't um put any scratches into my any of my horses or things so you guys, in the last video, I need you to go watch part one and part two. And in part two, I asked, what horses do you think are coming? My main horses that are coming on vacation with me. And that's going to be figured out in this video. But first, we need to add a hay net because I stuffed my hay nets very full that I only bring one when they go on a trailer trip because uh, if I stuff both hay nets full, uh, my horses would be very fat because I absolutely stuff them. So I kind of have to give a bit or use one for each. So I tied up my uh, briar hay net and then put it on like the little feeder bit of the Schleich trailer um, and so both of the horses can reach it. It was right there and then it's also tied up to both the bars but now the moment you all have been waiting for is showing you guys what horses are coming with me. So let's start with our first horse and this is midnight we are bringing midnight my new dressage mare in her pretty purple tack and the um colors of their halters kind of helps hint so we're gonna get her and we're gonna put her in this um right side of the trailer so i'm just gonna pull it off so i can get her in and a lot of you are like why do you not have your head colors on because they're so good and they'll get out of the trailer and they'll wait for us to put their head collars on so yeah so got that another hint is they're both girls so that is a girl and we are bringing Toronto yay Toronto's coming Toronto's coming and a lot of my friends are like bring Toronto you have to bring Toronto god bring her please 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 I'm like fine and so I did it, even though I really wanted to bring her. She comes on almost every vacation with me, and a lot of you are probably like, Tronta has a baby. Yes, Tronta does have a baby, but we do have another mare that will take care of the baby, and we are going to be bringing the baby with us in a bag so Tronta can still feed the baby. Because the baby is still like one month, so it's still really young. But it we, it does really grow up with the other mare that um, helps Tronta a lot. And the, the Tronta helps that other mare. So they're like best buddies. So the the two mares, because they both lost one of their foals. They were supposed to have twins and then just didn't work. So, yeah. So they're really, they were used to having, and she's had twins before and they both survived. So, yeah, she's used to having two bulls in there they find they fit fine in the stall so yeah we're gonna put her into the trailer and then close that on up and then that's like our main thing 
but a lot of you are probably like, what people are you bringing? I am bringing some of my main writers because they are like the most skilled out of all of them. So yeah, but I'm gonna make you guys wait again because I'm gonna make them in another video. So bye guys, I hope you guys are ready to see part four of the video. Bye everybody.